haven't told anyone which is my favorite hot sauce, particularly in this category. So stick around. If you're watching this on a toilet pushing fire right now, which you probably are, hit subscribe and turn on all notifications to be a part of a day squad. Welcome back to the Hot Dane Show. Now, I got favorite hot sauce in many different categories, but this category is dessert. You can probably squeeze in, in the other categories as well, but this is one of my absolutely favorite, favorite hot sauce, beef sack sauces, and they're located in Jacksonville, Florida. And I think they have a website called beefsacksauces.com. Well, you see here, I have fresh mango, coconut, and sauce barnet, fresh pineapple, coconut, habanero, fresh pineapple, mango, and habanero. Oh, which shall I pick? I can pick this one. I had these hot sauces, so I'm gonna pretend to get my first time. To this thing letter, a nice long write-up, but I'm not gonna read them all. It said, Beach Hot Sauces is a small batch hot sauce company. Our goal is to use the bold, fresh flavor of a tropic to create a flavor palette that will let your taste buds escape to the Caribbean. Amazing sweet heat of this pineapple, mango, and habanero pepper sauce will become your island favorite. The bold, fresh, tropical, sweet tart flavor of a pineapple complement of a sweetness and a hint of citrus from the mango. Has the fruity flavor of a Caribbean build and suddenly get the sharp, spicy heat of a habanero. Then the sizzling spiciness begin to mellow with the sweetness of a fresh tropical fruit. Every layer come together perfectly. Ah, ah I'm already excited. Ah, wow, the pineapple, the mango, the aroma, it gets it, phenomenal. Just a reminder, I'm not getting paid for doing this to say anything. <laughs> it gets from the heart. Now, I love the little thickness, the consistency. It's like some apple sauce. I like thick sauce. Here we go. Have a little kick. Um, what I mean by kick is the, the happy little scene. Oh, I, I can literally drink a whole bottle. Mmm. Mmm. Uh, the heat girl, it did stay hot here. It does have a little kick. Um, it gets a slight burn, not much. I would give it a uh, Fernand Chili Head, maybe a two, maybe a three. Uh, for me, do I need to explain? Mm. Wow. Let's go with this one. This is a pineapple, coconut, and habanero. Let's see what she said here. Your mouth will love the amazing sweet heat of the pineapple, coconut, and habanero pepper sauce. First, you get a sharp, spicy heat of habanero. Then the sizzling spiciness begins to mellow and the layer comes together. The lively, fresh, tropical, sweet tart flavor of a pineapple is complemented by the coconut nuttiness of a hint of vanilla. For the perfect, fresh, bold taste of Caribbean. I love the label, the color. You know, they're all consistent of uh, the design. It's, it's green tropical. And you know what you're getting when you see a label like this. The thick thoughts. I love the pour. I mean, I could smell the aroma. Mmm. Coconut. Wow. I mean, I love coconut. I can live off on coconut. In fact, I just had uh, a coconut water and with the meat the other day. Uh, but anyway. Can nut it? Man, nutty, fruity. Mm. It got a more of a texture to it. You know, like, like a grind up a coconut. I think what it is. I think that's what it is, coconut. It's a coconut uh, meat.
Mm. I mean, these sausages just, just made my day. Uh, same thing, uh, the heat rise for nine chili head, maybe a two or three. Uh, for me, I think you can take a hint. Ah, it's so flavorful. Uh, it's a coconut, pineapple. Got a little thing of a habanero. Hmm. Ah, gotta love this. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and uh, check out the last one. This one is mango, coconut, and sauce barnet. A little bit more warmer. It says an amazing flavor of this mango, coconut, and sauce barnet. Hot sauce, green, the fresh, old taste of Caribbean. Then the hot sauce first hits your mouth. The sweet habanero with a hint of lime combined with the fresh, tropical taste of coconut. A little nutty and a hint of vanilla has these robust flavor build a slight hint of apple and cherry emerge and the spicy heat of scotch bonnet flowed with flavor. Then the tropical fresh flavor merged with a bite of Dr. Barnett began to mellow, leaving you with the perfect old Caribbean sweet heat. Any more words on the paper, I'm going to end up eating the paper. <laughs> I like to have a pour. Yeah. But again, I can see some little touch of, uh, hint the coconut. Hey. Right. That one got a little more bite to it. But, damn it, it's so good. I think Dicky might be a little more creamier. Mm. I'm telling you guys have no idea. If you've never had these sausages, there's no other way that I can explain it how delicious they are. You just gotta go. Ah. What are these guys? I mean, they get perfect for pork, uh, maybe fish. Um, even though you're gonna dessert calories, nah, you could probably put on ice cream or, or something. But I have a better idea. Taco. I like this one. This one got a little more kick to it. More flavor. For a nine chili head, I'd probably go up maybe a three or four. Me, probably a one. I kept it. Like I said, five ounces of butter. Not big enough for me. Make it 54 inches. 54 inches. Make it 54 ounces. 54 inches. Whew! Man, that is so good. All right. Based on the spectrum of my face, which you think is my favorite out of all the three? Without hesitation. Mango, coconut, and sauce bonnet. Time to put it on my taco. I got this taco from Costco. Um, they come in a big crate for like, what, $5.99? You probably get about seven or eight tacos out of it. Oh yeah, I'm gonna put my favorite favorite sauce on a taco. See, that's why, that's why I like to put a lot of sauce on my food. And that's why five ounces is just not enough for me, to be honest. I haven't had to have this on taco yet. So I think it's gonna be my first time. I've been putting this on hamburger, pizza, whatnot, but let's take on this uh, chicken taco at Costco. Here we go. Mmm. You guys are missing out. Mm. 
you gotta go over to know the heat scale on this. But let me give you my flavor scale. Out of 1 to 10, I give it a 9.5 of my flavor scale. Mmm. It's just phenomenal. Well, guys, grab a hold of these sauces at beachsacksauces.com. Um, say hello to Susie uh, for me if you can. And if you happen to be in the area in Jacksonville, Florida, in fact, I'm going to be back in Florida in a few months. I may pay the visit to see her. Okay, thank you for the incredible thoughts. This is so good. Thank you. I love this. So, well, I think that's all for the show for today. I'll see you next time on a hot dance show. Mm-hmm.